Okay, what's up everybody? We're just gonna readjust this tiny bit. So, this video is kinda crazy that I'm making this. Like, this is actually gonna be real, like holy crap. I mean, yeah, I probably shouldn't be making it as big of a deal as like it is, cause it's not that big of a deal. But, to me, it's kinda crazy. Kind of like an end of an era, a beginning of a new era, something like that. You guys know what I'm talking about, right? I mean, I hope you guys saw the title, and that's why you clicked on it, and that's why you're watching me now, but this video is going to be a little intense, and we're just going to get straight into it. We're just going to start already. Make sure you guys subscribe. Subscribe to my Claylea Vlogs channel to see lots of fun videos going on there, because I've got a lot of really fun stuff there, so go check that out. And yeah, basically... Like the title says, I am going to be deleting TikTok forever, which is gonna be a little bit intense and hard for me, but you know what? It's gonna be good. So basically, we're gonna start from the beginning. I have been on TikTok since about, since 2016, maybe 2017. Um, you can see my first ever video with my dad. That was really funny. My dad has been on the first TikTok and then now coming to the very end, He's been in all, all of those ones, and he ended up actually starting his own. Kind of funny how started and now it's ending. But I've been on it since it was called Musical.ly, and uh, you know, we were doing lots of lip syncing types of videos, lots of just transitions, lots, lots of transitions. You can see all these different types of transitions that we're doing, and uh, it was really fun. And at the time, TikTok was a very innocent, very like family friendly. Yeah, there were other songs or maybe a few little like sketchy things that's the word we're gonna use because i can't figure out the other word but like it wasn't really bad at least not that i can remember so don't call me out if it was i mean it probably was i'm not 100 percent sure but it was very family friendly at least from what i remember Loved being on it, loved interacting with all of you guys, and we have grown so much. Like, it is crazy how many of you guys I have started following me fall and following along with my journey. Basically, watching me like grow up. I don't know if any of you guys have been here from the start. I know one person, but you know who you are. Um, I did some duets with you and stuff, so there have been some of you that have been like growing up with me. I think that is so cool. That is like, oh, I love you guys so much. It's so crazy. Now time's passing and it turned to TikTok, which has been still fun. Lots of fun dances. And I personally love dances. So that was really, really fun. Then it started turning a little bit not as family friendly. That's when TikTok went like viral. Basically all the movie stars, all these really big end people start going on it, posting, and I'm not saying they were the ones doing bad things. I mean anyone and everyone was like posting on it and stuff. And basically I just felt for myself that it wasn't the best for me. 
I was seeing lots of videos with like swearing in it and lots of immodest videos and the dances can be a little bit like sexy which is not something I want to do. If you guys notice in all my in all my TikTok videos, I normally have a tank top under if it's a crop top. This isn't a crop top, that's why there's no tank top. But I was usually wearing tank tops. I never did any of the songs with the swear words or I made sure it was like beeped out. But so I made sure I was pretty family friendly. And then dances started getting a little bit more risque, that's the word. And so I just felt like it wasn't the best for me. Now, no judgment to all of you guys, TikTok is not bad, it's not bad. I just felt, me personally, it wasn't a good intake for myself. And uh, as you guys know, I am starting to post more on Clearly Vlogs. I've got my necklace launching, and I am actually working on a few more products right now. So make sure you guys go and click the link down below and get yourself a necklace. And so I have been just really busy trying to grow this business, basically, and this family. and. Uh, TikTok was kind of on the downscale of that, if that makes sense. So I decided that I'm going to be deleting it. It's so sad, you guys. You have no idea how hard like this actually is um, uh, to do this because, like, I've been on TikTok doing lots of fun dances, you know, in Disneyland. We've got some from Disneyland with all of our family. <laughs> some from like maybe even Hawaii I'm not even sure but just oh and in Switzerland it's just it's super fun to look back on all of them and see like oh my goodness this memory and this memory so it, there's a lot of memories to it because I've been on there for almost like four almost five years or so so it's kind of crazy um, I mean I'm definitely gonna be keeping all my videos gotta keep them even though some of them are cringy as heck you guys are gonna be seeing a lot more clay vlogs I might even actually start posting two times a week um, uh, you'll be seeing lots more jewelry coming out, lots more products coming out, um, and I want your guys' help with that as well, as well as my Instagram. I'll be doing lots more interaction on Instagram, because TikTok was actually where I did my most interaction. So Instagram, I will be doing so much more that word on there, you know, words. We get it. I am so excited to keep going with this journey, basically. I'm making this much bigger of a deal than it should be, but... It's fine. It's okay. We're good. So I thank you guys so much for all of your support and for following me along on this journey. And I am so excited to keep going with this with you guys and growing together. So yeah, I'm really excited. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.